so I, I get a lot of enjoyment out of spending half a day just walking around the zoo. I feel like I'm fulfilling a work-related part of my, my life so that it's not frivolous, wasted time, but I also find it relaxing. And sometimes I don't use the camera at all. I just walk around and look, and sometimes I take my binoculars. You see a lot of birds there, even wild, that you don't see in the rest of the rest of the city because they're attracted to the feeding areas for the other birds and because it's a nice wild area down at Rock Creek Park. I uh, enjoy doing scratch boards of animals that are white when I'm doing the black scratch board so they, they certainly lend themselves to a black background. I've done a few polar bears. I, I find polar bears to be one of the most interesting animals because they they're truly wild they're not like um, any other bear that people run into they're they're not afraid of people they we are simply another prey species to them and i find that interesting and i think that they're just beautiful animals they're completely wild there's nothing they don't run away from people the way uh, other wildlife do they just don't don't think of us as being threatening at all they're, we are simply another interesting thing for them to investigate I also have a picture called Longleaf Pines. It's a large scratch board with deer in it. I first of all set myself out to meet the challenge of trying to do a larger picture. Scratch board only comes in a certain size and I doubled the sheet, uh, taped it together, did the picture and had to work out a way of joining them so that you could not see the join. And I'm pretty satisfied with the result, uh, plus I enjoyed doing an entire landscape instead of just a vignette as I used to do. Probably the most important thing in art is, is light and dark, getting light correct, uh, values, and if you're working in color, getting the colors right um, under sunlight and under darkness. That, uh, that's what makes it look like a sculpture and um, brings out the three-dimensionality. The nice thing about scratchboard, again, is you get the high contrast, so you can exploit that as far as you want. I find scratch boards easier to do than pen and inks because they're smoother. Um, pen and ink, technically, uh, you're, you're sort of fighting the paper in a way, and the instruments are a little more difficult to use. Sometimes a, a good uh, technical pen clogs frequently. I primarily work with wildlife. Occasionally I do portraits, and when I do them, they're a labor of love. I would never do one as a commission, uh, knock on wood. I would never. I'm not interested in doing them unless it's a subject that really interests me. I did this portrait of Wynton Marsalis, who's a jazz musician, just for fun. I was very happy with the way it turned out and did another one subsequently of his brother. I was happy to give them to him because I admire his work very much and I felt like he gave me jazz music and I could give him something that I had done. I think one of the reasons that Scratchboard appeals to me is because not many other people do do scratch boards, so I feel like I'm in an area that I can excel in. I'm not finished when I finish the piece because it still has to hang somewhere, and I want it to. My opening at the National Wildlife Federation um, was one of the busiest days I've ever had. Uh, I felt great. The whole thing was very enjoyable. It's the first show I've ever had of my own. One of the most satisfying things about the opening was finally some people that I knew, a lot of people I knew, whether well or just casually, got to see what I am most serious about. I'm only working half time now. In the future, I hope to uh, work full time as an artist. I'm slowly working toward that goal by having more work in shows and in more galleries. My best days doing artwork are when I have the whole day and evening ahead of me where I can just sit down and have no other plans, nothing to do except sit down, do my artwork, and um, finish whenever I want and not have to clean up and not have to go out. It's just listening to music and, and doing my scratch boards.